Tyson Fury, ranked number 11. He made 57 million. That's pretty impressive. Conor McGregor, ranked number 16, made 48 million. What? Conor made 48 million? That's impressive too because he only fought one time, if I'm not mistaken. Habib, when did Habib whoop his tail? I think Habib whooped his tail in 2018. I don't think it's 2019. Correct me if I'm wrong. If it's in, with one fight alone, that's impressive. I think I got my years mixed up or something. You know, but um, Anthony Joshua is ranked number 19 at 47 million. That's impressive. He beat Deontay Wilder this year. Deontay Wilder at 46.5 million? That's number 20. Okay. I'm actually shocked because this is my first time viewing the list. But um, Deontay Wilder should be making more than Tyson Fury if we are being honest. I mean, how did that happen? <laughs> then Canelo Alvarez, he at number 30. The, the face of boxing. <laughs> That don't got the cojones to fight the best. That's what happens. You go down the rankings. You ain't making no type of money you're supposed to be making. 37 million. That's still good money though. So 37 million is not bad. But it ain't what it ain't what Deontay Wilder is making though. It ain't what Canelo it ain't what Tyson Fury is making. Or Anthony Joshua. So um That's a pretty good amount of money. Four fighters from the sport of boxing. And then one from the UFC. That's why you know if you're a fighter and, and you want to come up and you got talent, you might want to go and dive into boxing the UFC because in the in the UFC, they pretty much robbing you, man. I mean, in the UFC, I don't know. How, they fight for chump change. And you could lose so many ways. I really just don't get it, you know. Um, but who is the face of boxing? One fighter with all the controversy from the glove gate and the wild boar and Canelo Alvarez obviously ain't the face of boxing from not fighting the best to the contaminated meat to, you know what I'm saying, he ain't making the most money at this point because he ain't fighting the best. So, of course, they're not going to offer him the right amount of money. So, it has to be at this point, obviously, Tyson Fury because they're going to do whatever it takes to protect that record of his. I mean, they trying to compare him to Muhammad Ali and all that. Now, Tyson Fury, after I don't, the man, just like we seen, right? you are seeing all this, what we just talked about when it came to this controversy. Tyson Fury pretty much allegedly cheated, right? And he got away with it. Red-handed. Why? Because of double standards. You know, so um, everything always happened for a reason. Um, but AJ versus the winner of Wilder versus Fury is going to be interesting, and that's really going to be the face of Biden. Uh, the whole thing about the Tyson Fury is the number one purse leader. How in the world did that happen? What, uh, what pay-per-views has this man done besides the Wilder Fury fight? Uh, no. I, I, I completely think that's bullshit. I don't know. I don't know. Like I There's said, two I've, fights I, before that was Otto Wilder. I feel uh, like, Wilder and, and, and I, I don't know, Tom Schwartz. Tom like, Schwartz. You know uh, somebody that was ranked number 63. <laughs> On, on the rankings, so um, with something like that. So, like I say, it was un two unknown fighters, um, and I don't know. Like I, from what I heard, he was pre pretty much getting paid like a million or so. I mean, I don't know what happened. I mean, I don't know if they telling the truth, but it is what it is. You know, um, they do want a white hope, and he is Superman. So that's the only way. But if, if we if we being honest, he didn't even sell tickets. They they had to get give away tickets. The fight with Tom Swartz, he sold five oh, k. Yeah, five k for the Tom Swartz where they where they gave away one hundred k one thousand k. I mean, excuse me, I don't know what I'm talking. Yeah, about. Uh, he he sold five k five thousand tickets right, and they gave away one thousand tickets. On the other hand, the 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 Wallen fight, uh, he sold three thousand tickets, and they gave away nearly two thousand tickets. So where the hell is this money coming from? Like that he's generating. You know what I'm saying? It was Deontay Wilder that actually sold like the pay per view. So I don't know what they talking about. Man, yeah, I, I, I saw that list the other day, man. I was like, this is complete bullshit. I don't know what they got going for, for Tyson Fury. They really trying to make this man the face of box. He's preparing him to Ali is this complete, oh, utter man. bullshit. Listen, I Ali, need to... hold on, hold on, hold on. No, we can't even do that. We can't even put him in the same sentence, in the same breath. They don't belong together. That's a cold breath. That's a hot breath. Because one thing for sure, Ali never cheated. Ali 
got it out the mud. Ali fought for his people. Ali fought the best. On the other hand, this man cheated on more than one occasion for the steroids at, during one incident on the glove gate on another incident, incident allegedly. And then just to make it clear, you know, there's no comparison. Muhammad Ali, not even at his best, beat George Foreman and Frazier. And um, on the other hand, uh, my, you know, uh, Tyson Fury, man, the only two name fighters he really fought as good as Wilder and and, uh, and Klitschko. Other than that, you know, he and never really defended his, the title in his, in his career. Never. Muhammad Ali defended his never title defended 18 his times, title. 18 times. And they took away his third, three of his prime years or fourth of his prime years due to him speaking out for his people. And people still suffering to this day. So uh, with that being said,